Now here's an extremely unique tweak. It is called Terminal Activator. It is a tweak that allows you to use your terminal and use terminal commands to run activator actions. For instance, let me just show you right here. If I type out notify and then underscore, well, I mean underscore, not dash, notify underscore, and I type in post and then type test like that, and then I hit return on the keyboard, it will lock my device. Now, how did it know to do that? Well, that's because I set up a command in terminal activator to be able to pull that off here. So let me just show you one last time. There it is, notify underscore post test, and there it is, it'll lock the device. So let me show you how I did this. Let's head over to our settings app, and there is terminal activator settings panel, and you notice right here I have test, and that is the action that we just ran in the terminal. And if I execute that command, it'll perform whatever activator action I have assigned to it. And right here is a little help guide that shows you how to use the command. So you type notify underscore post and then the name of your command, just like that at the terminal. So let me just show you the event I have for test. You can see, that I can set up um, any type of activator action for tests that I want. So I can make it activate notification center, for instance. So I'm gonna type in notify underscore post test, and then if I hit return on the keyboard, it will load up notification center just like that. So you can use this to do pretty much any activator action and assign it to a custom command using terminal activator, it's that simple. Now, as far as who would need to use this, I don't know why anyone would need to use this. I'm sure it'll have a use for some advanced users, but normal users aren't gonna want to run activator actions via a terminal. Nonetheless, the fact that you can do it makes it worth doing. Terminal activator is available on Cydia's Big Boss repo for free. Let me know what you think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.